Uh, uh, re-roll maybe. your re re-roll your attempt again. All right. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's probably a race. Yeah, that's wait, a race. Wait, wait. I can't see it. What did he get? He got I hit a twenty-one. Oh yeah, that's a fucking that's a race. And now do I uh, roll my uh? You roll your damage, but you roll your e six to it. I I roll your six. So it's your strength. Um, so I, I'm at my weapon, my melee weapon. I'm at Terry Silver Pipe Wrench. Should I on a rage? Should I select D6? No, no. Yes. What happens is yeah, on a rage you put a D, you put a D6 on the character sheet. But here's how uh, you roll your strength plus your weapon's damage to roll. Yeah, see, I, I was, I'm gonna roll from my weapons. Uh, yeah, from oh. my yeah weapon. just roll from the. Sh just roll from this. Yeah. And, I, and on the raise, on the raise section, I'm selecting D6, right? Yeah, yes. that's what you do. You just put it as a D6 when you get I get raise. so confused. Let's yeah. see this. That's what you do. Oh my god, how the hell did... That was unlucky. Oh, no, fuck that. It's a 7. You yeah, can't Benny damage. You can't Benny damage. You can't Benny damage. Can't Benny oh, okay, damage, okay. Yeah. Yeah, and don't waste bad. bennies. I'm, I'm gonna say this now, I won't let you waste bennies. What did rolling a seven? Well, it's not really a wa wasted binny, in my opinion. Yeah. But what is... I know, oh, but I... Lexagard's toughness is seven, so he's at least shaken. Yeah. Yeah, he is. He's shaken. And, and he, he, he... He's like, oh, what are you doing? <laughs> Yeah, the way the way Savage World works is he shake the like normally you shake you put people into shaken first and then if you attack them again it's much easier to damage them. Okay. Oh god, I got it. I was trying to get this character sheet out of the way, but it's really big. If yeah, you double click yeah. the top of it, it'll. There we are. It. All right, I got, it, an, I got it. There's an X you can click on. For now, now can I uh, run behind Valamontis and say and point to him saying he did it? You moved already in your turn, so... No, you can, you can move you can twice. Move. Yeah. yeah. Alright, really? nice. You so can move that. attack and then move again. Run to Palavantis and it's really? saying, he yeah. did it! As long as you have oh. movement left, and he didn't move very much, so he should. Yeah. Oh, right. You oh, you mean in... oh, it's in the move frame. Okay, never mind. I thought you could only move once. <laughs> Boom. Uh, I, did, I did it. Basically, Savage Worlds is you announce everything you're going to do before you do it, but movement is... As long as you haven't moved six inches, you can just keep going. So basically, seeing that Lex was distracted, Terry quickly gets out his pipe wrench, uh, runs, does like a little uh, scurry, jumps up, like smashes him in the head, and then runs towards Valamontis. Runs right over here. Uh, I'm going to say, for the sake of future party relations, Throndal did not see Terry do that. He was a little <laughs> bit busy with the Shadow Stalker. Yeah. Uh, anyway, it's it's just, just as well. All right, um, so I'm going to push forward a little bit, um, and then I am going to fire two shots uh, with my staff, fire beam of magic at um, both of these chumps. So I was spending two power points. Do these things have any armor? Uh, no. Okay. Thank okay. you. All right, um, and I believe it's a D8 to attack because I'm using a ranged magic spell. Okay, so that's the first one. I'll just roll yep. my second. You just... Uh, yeah. Roll your, roll your uh, d6s as well to see if yeah, yeah, cause, we can raise yeah. this out. Okay. Alright. Uh, nah, same same result, really. Um, hey, you okay. one of them. Yeah. Actually, both of them. Uh, yeah, yeah, I hit both. Yeah. Mm. Um, no, it's the toughness is six. No, no it, but with range. Oh, oh shot, yeah, it's yeah, four. Shit, it's... yeah. Um, so, oh okay. crap. Yeah, it's all right. I didn't, um, I didn't apply it to magic as well. Yeah. Um, and I have completely forgotten the damage damage for magic. It's a D six, wasn't it? Two, no. Two D four in your case, because you. Yeah. yeah. Oh yes. Light. You have armor. Yeah. Armor yes. Well, two D four. That's the first one. Eleven. Oh god. Well it's Well I think one of them's fucked. Five. So one yeah, fucked, that doesn't one that... not fucked yet. No, Cecilia still... just kinda of steps forward, just goes pew pew. Oh good, you killed the one that uh what's gonna be next? Yes. How efficient is off yes. the board. Okay. Uh, is that... yeah, it is your turn. Alright, I wanna try to uh, I guess one of my my powerpoints goes from uh, maintaining smite, and then uh, I want to try to club this guy in whatever most resembles a face on it. 
Am I going to bring out the bell again in editing? Yep. Let's see now. I hope, I hope so. Oh yeah, I forgot about the bell. Oh, uh, well, that probably... Doesn't. Ooh, oh wait, no, it's a six. Yes. I can't believe I'm rolling so low. Six. I have a d10 in fighting. So... I have a d12. Yeah, but uh -huh. it's just yes. really bad luck rolling a six. A d12 really isn't helping me that much, considering the both the agility tricks have blown up in my face. So I do I hit it? Yeah, you, you, you hit it. Cool, cool. Uh, okay. So, it's not with a raise, with my damage. There it is. Uh, okay. Yes. Ooh, oh. Uh huh. Um. Do you want to? Uh, I'll let you, for flavor text, describe how you smite. Well, this what thing. does this thing look like? Is it like a giant snake? I could show you a picture. Well, I'm just going off of the. It it it's not a snake. No, it's like a it's it's taller than you, but it's like much lankier. Okay. Uh. Uh, Throndal just sort of like swings his hammer horizontally towards the cart, and he he smashes the thing's head uh, like between his hammer and the cart. Aye. I'm assuming there's just like, you know, stuff. There's there's just the dust evaporation and semen. Right. Okay, that last one is exaggerated. Th Throndal licks the, the semen up <laughs> and and what? marches forward mightily. So here... So that's where dwarves get their power. Right. There he is. Have a look. So, so are all of the... Are all of the sh Shadow Stalkers dead? Oh, I see. Ah, this yes. fight over. Is the, the fight is over. Uh, okay. Frontal, okay. How, how is Lex feeling? Oh, yeah. Forgot. Uh, well, I just, Lex... I just spent like, my... Like, looking at Lex like, oh, He's not gonna like that. Lex gets up from his endazement and just... He literally, without even noticing you two, pushes both Balamontis and Zestia inside and just looks at Terry with a very stern, angry look. Are what? you accusing me of something, Mr. Guard? Oh, I'm accusing you of a lot, all right. What the hell do you think you were doing there? Uh, I was getting to cover. I don't know what happened to you. I mean... I thought the Shadow Stalker was already dead, but apparently it just smacked you upside the head and you didn't even notice. He Is points, there some sort of problem here? He points a finger up at you, literally in your face, and says, You're on thin ice, Terry. Thin fucking ice. <laughs> I'm warning you. Oh, I know you will. Come on now. Alright, Throndal does his usual thing and gathers some uh, ash from the thing. And puts it in his, in his beard pouches. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, hello, Jess. You've missed quite a bit. Uh, just to lot of tell you about the Neo, uh, she is my co-host. Who helped me make this series. Anyway. Um, so you would like to descend further, because there isn't really anything else here. You can see like there's a little manhole here that leads further in. Well, let's... I want to look down it first before we descend. My money like making scheme down? was. Uh... I'll just let you see it back on the recording, but yeah, you missed it. <laughs> it didn't work out so well. Um, yeah, I want to look down there. Uh, is it dark? It's dark. Yeah. Okay, so I can see then. Yes, you can. You 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 are able to see down there. Um, the ladder seems to go on for quite a while, but. Yeah, you can definitely tell it is very dark. None of the others are able to see into it very well. Do I see anything of importance, or is it just a ladder going down? The ladder goes down, and you just see like a little plain path. You can't really tell from there on. Terry, it looks uh, pretty safe to me. Why don't you go ahead and... This hole is even holier than the last hole. That's right. It's like round. Who's going to descend first? Great craftsmanship on I'm, this I'm suggesting very highly that Terry should go first. I think I think Lex should go first. I had the honor of going down the first. I hole. agree. Lex, you should go first. Oh, for God's sake! Fine. 
if it let if it gets us on our mission further. And then, and he points his head up, like almost cartoonishly. Thin fucking ice. <laughs> I wait for him to get halfway down the ladder, and then I jump down. Um, so we'll say right now that you you spend like a couple of uh, minutes walking through a dark cavern that only Frondel is able to make out the detailing. He notices that there are like carvings of where ore was mined out and rich gems. I, I try to lead Balmontis around in such a way that he constantly like knocks his knees on things and trips. <laughs> Why Balmontis? Because he doesn't like because... <laughs> Okay, we, fine. Just we have a dynamic gun. <laughs> Every time, just like, Frondor, you're not very good at getting your way through these caves, are you? I can see why you came to the surface, aside from getting away of more of your kin. Sorry about that, <sighs> I'll uh, try to go, I'll try to lead you a bit better. Oh, uh, watch out there, you, you want to go to the left, just a little bit. Ow! My skull. <laughs> yeah, we, just, say, we make like that the whole way. Yeah, yeah, and um, as you delve deeper, the little spiders, the li little spiders, but the big, very weird, <laughs> uh, the spiders seem to be crawling in more packs now, and they seem to be led from somewhere. I should mention at this point that I am a severe arachnophobe. <laughs> I remember from that past conversation <laughs> fucking ages ago, and I was like, oh, thinking about that. All right, so you eventually it's end up here. It's always spiders. It's always spiders. Deeper into the cavern, and the spiders are performing in packs. Uh oh. Oh yeah. Oh, by the way, they're on the token layer now. Yay! Yay! Oh boy. They appear to be appearing in more numbers. Hmm. Very good. The the Lex uh, approaches further. He's he seems to recognize this place. I remember an expedition like this before. Is this the place that your mother brought you to try and abandon you? <laughs> oh! What? What, is Zestia on his side now? <laughs> no, no, she's just going, oh. oh! Shit, son. At this point, I'm just tired of like some shit. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Balamontis? Could I, could I just speak to you over here for a minute? Next to I the, keep my uh... distance, knowing what he's capable of, but <laughs> alone. I, I just walk over here anyway, and just look over here, and just go. That's the ugliest damn hole I've ever seen. Alone, Terry. What is uh, it? All right. Now. Oh, it's a. Uh, you... It's a grave. Now you think you have everyone fooled, but I know who you are, Mister Pirates. Dun dun dun. I don't even. No, I've let. I don't even think like. Well, I've got enough money to just leave if you tell everyone. So, frankly, it means nothing to me. But you did try and kill me, so um, you're fucked. <laughs> we'll see about that. Belmontis, uh, well, while he's talking, can, can I, can I, can I try and? I, I look at Frondel and say, "Yes, that man back there. Oh, he's." I just, I lean in and whisper as far away from Lex as I can. He's threatening me. Mm. Did you? Do you deserve it? Well, <laughs> most of the time, yes, but in this case, <laughs> in this, in, only in this instance. Mm. I'll keep an eye out. So anyway, um, you pick up from Lex that he seems to be spiteful of you. Oh, I. It I might have been up. from your, you know, your history. Are, obviously, obviously, obviously no, party. no, really, I didn't <laughs> pick that up. Obviously, but you know, yeah, he seems to be having. He has some vendetta against you, and it might um, be because of your. Only for the whole party. Well, I think he likes Frondel. Fr no, no, no. Fr Frondel and Zestia he has no problem with, but obviously yeah. Terry, because you're... A well, I, 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 every guard has a problem with Terry. Yeah, you're, you're a convict, and yeah. Balamontis, because of his history and piracy. But you aren't, but you, you don't know why he has that vendetta against you, but I just, Balamontis. I just kind of, like, look Frondel, and I try and muster up the most kind of... 
a serious look I can get when I'm trying to be a shit dick and just say he's corrupt and I know it. But that's between you and me. Mm. Keep that in mind. Alright, I wanna I wanna lick this is this a grave over here? Um you can have a, you can inspect the hole if you want. Yeah. I'll inspect that hole. I'll inspect all over that hole. I'm gonna delve into that. I'm not a fan of how Do you have an inspection? Or notice? Uh <laughs> okay, roll your notice if you Rolling a trained again. Hey, I got a one again. <laughs> Fine. Uh, you don't unearth anything. Of notice, it's just an old shovel, just still deep into there. Literally, the only advantage I have, it, as far as being in here, is that I can see in the dark. I have no notice skill at all. Hey, this hole is my size. Yes, I'm <laughs> quite lucky you are. Terry, you're very close to me. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> Terry, please stop touching me there. <laughs> <laughs> I just. In my kind I like of... how you, I like how you're completely doing nothing, Tim. Yeah, uh, <laughs> she's I've... just going like. Uh... I just you're pick like, up. I'm just I'm staying out of this one. <laughs> I go over here. I pick up this shovel and I throw it down um, here. Oh, thanks for down reloading my pistols, Belmontes Ferner. Yeah, the oh, grammar this... on that was a bit fucked. I appreciate you. Oh, oh, okay, my okay. <laughs> All right, as uh, actually, I can pick that up. Uh... Let me see if I can get so I'm probably on so the you... map layer. Yeah, I just yeah, throw it down and then just like listen for anything moving. The spiders all scatter there and they all seem to make the screeching clicking noises. There seems to be a much more distinct louder one from there. <laughs> ah, uh from the giant like spider down that way. You wanna go first? I don't like this. I think that spider might be a criminal. Hey Lex! The, the screeching dies out very slowly and then faint. Hmm. Perhaps we should try to draw them out to here. It'd be no, slightly I've got more a, defensible. I've got a brilliant idea, okay? Us four will go down the part that go down this path, and I point to it. We'll split the party so that Lex goes down this pathway. I, I have a feeling he might not agree with that. Yes, you're quite right, I won't. Well, I, I didn't expect you to come around there, to the <laughs> Well, I can hear you. Why don't we try to drag out whatever is down that tunnel to where we are so that we can be prepared? That's a very good idea. Do uh, you have anything that could uh, create a loud noise, maybe? Oh, I've got a few is things. He, I just pull out a pistol and fire it. Maybe a it. pistol, for example? <laughs> That's what I was... Yeah, I already got, oh, I got Yeah, you have to fire your pistol into there, but... Are you trained? Well, I'm... I, I'm not trying to hit anything, I'm just pulling a trigger. Yeah, he's, he's literally just trying to make noise okay, with it. fine. I pull okay, a trigger, I stamp you... my feet, and I yell, I'm Valamontus <laughs> Verna! I am I more important than you, and you should probably <laughs> come and see me! I'm like, I'm like, Valamontus, we should have, you know, got into a position before you did that, maybe? I imagine it's like Yosemite Sam. He's just, you know, like, yeah. doing like a really big, like, thrashing dance. He's like, like dancing like... around and shooting. <laughs> yeah. I wish I had revolvers at this point so I could fire them more than once. But, you right, know. Uh, so, have you fired your pistol? Of this tunnel. Yeah, uh, fired my pistol and I just quickly set about reloading the goddamn thing. A few spiders crawl out, but they don't really do anything. Uh, no, you don't hear any other noises either. Mm. So far, this plan is uh, working out splendidly. Well, I'm imagining if you don't want to see spiders, then this is a complete success. <clears throat> uh, I've... <sighs> Sod it, I'm resigned to die early anyway, and I start walking I, down. I, I, I'm just going to go over here and go, Hey, spiders! Saw your mother at the brothel last night. You fucking what? <laughs> it's like the it's like the horse before. <laughs> all the animals escape, all they talk. This like Cockney accent. Uh, I mean, a fucking laugh ain't your might. Well, he <laughs> thinks that they they what? if they could, they'd have the capacity to talk to you, but they can only think it. So, are we gonna split up the party? Are you are you splunking in there? What are you doing? Uh, I just I resigned myself to an down. early death, and uh, I've started walking. I'll... Yeah, okay. I'm going to go down here. 
Now, Lex, I think we should go together. Alone. <laughs> I draw a sword in one hand, a pistol on my off hand, and just start he, he, he just looks at you and says, please, please stop touching me there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to say where he's... I'll just leave that to imagination. I'm just going to move these tokens. All right, so... All right, I'm going to reveal what Snake and Co. Uh, see. Before, before we go, uh, I stop Balmontis, and I want to use armor on him. Okay. What does the armor look like? It's a uh, fire, so it just sort of like... Um, it's, it's like a, a red tint to your armor and stuff, like bits oh, of smoke okay. off you. The, um, the time... I just roll for it. So. so Lex is going off with Zestia, then. Uh, I thought you were following. I prefer Tex. Let's see, unless, you're, unless, two... you're, uh, unless you're staying behind. Obviously, Wait, but you got two raise. parties too. Terry will just stay here and hold down the fort. Okay, <laughs> if, if well. you're getting a raise, you would have had a damage feel for 2D. Let's, uh, but you have hand... two points of armor. Yeah, that's good. Alright, so you guys ready? Yeah. Yep. I'm yep. walking. You, you splunk down further, and as it gets darker, but Frondel can clearly make out that, ta-da, there is a sleeping mother spider. Fucking... Hmm. I just, <laughs> I peek around the corner and look at it. It looks stretched. <laughs> okay. Belmontis, I realize subtle teeth it, isn't exactly our thing, but... The, pl uh, the platform you see braced along the pole there, there is a chest there. Uh, I'm just sort of like wrap an arm around Balmontis and whisper, and I'm like, I realize subtlety isn't our thing, but maybe we should, uh, you know, try our best here. Hang on, I'm going to go ask a favor of that guard who hates me. I'll be back in one moment. <laughs> I just sort of, like, try to let you squeeze by me. Yeah, it's very awkward. It's, it's like, go back and take room. Eventually, <laughs> I just climb over you instead. Yeah. Um, Lex, I've got a question to ask. Very well. Okay. Um, the mining here, did- was there ever blast mining by any chance? Because I figure we're going to need some explosives. I think it was my cousin who worked here, and yes, they did work with bli blast, blast mining. Fuck. Okay, do you think there would be any dynamite? Sorry, like, sorry, language. Hmm. Do you think there What's would- What's your profanity? Do you- sorry, what, what, sorry, what did you say again? Do you think there will be any explosives lying around? Mm. Well, don't worry, I don't plan to kill you with them. I uh, might. Thanks. He might, and I wouldn't be against it, but for now, we've got <laughs> bigger fish to fry. Oh, I believe you on that part, but I don't know if there is. I haven't really been here myself. Great. You're useless in every capacity, aren't you, Lex? Go fuck yourself, too. See you At later. At this point, Throndal has just sort of, like, lit up some pipe weed, and he's, he's very at edge. S smoking a little bit. I just, look, gonna go I just look. I just look under these two, hoping for some dynamite. Not Roll sure a notice. Why. Roll a notice. <laughs> roll a notice to find dynamite. Yeah, roll a notice to find dynamite. Um. Well. Ooh, do I, do I, oh. Oh. You do I find, find some dynamite. You find a big blast bomb. Ooh, a big blast bomb. Um, I kind of wish I had an air. The, you know the area uh, I, template. I'm just gonna go ahead and assume no one has any explosive skill. Uh, it's under throwing. None of us have throwing. You have the bomb, though. Uh, what are the usual um, stats for dynamite? Uh, sorry, um, grenades. Grenades? Or dynamite? Um, the American grenade is a 3d6. That's a grenade, though. Not, a, not um, what I'm imagining is a stick of dynamite. Well, this is, this is, this is from, is this, is, if this is from blast mining, I assume these would be placed charges, wouldn't they? True. Like, like, yeah, it should have like a giant fuse or like. It's got a long. Fuse. It's got a. It's got a moderate uh, to short fuse. Okay, so. So, what, so we're gonna. I'd, does it have a plunger as well then? Let Let's say it reach about uh, here. I should mention that Belmont is on fire right now. <laughs> oh yeah, shit! I'm holding it as far away from my armor as possible. Why is he on fire? Oh it's right, magic okay. fire. Oh yeah, shit. Um, I just walk up to Lex the guard while holding explosives and being on fire. I found some <laughs> explosives. But, but what's uh, this? Is I, a blast bomb. Um. Yes. Now I need you to do me another favor. 
Because I don't really respect your will to live that much. Um, you see those spiders? Yes, I've seen a lot of them here. Um, we found their mother. And yours, as a matter of fact. <laughs> God damn. Uh. Thorndal starts to do his usual, like, really loud laughing, and then he remembers that there's a giant uh, spider, a like, ten yards away, and he stops. There we are. Carry on. So, here's what I need you to do, okay, uh, old boy? I want you to run into the room, put this on the ground, and then run back out before the spider kills you. Well, okay. Or you as long as the bomb... I, 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 yeah, I'll, I'll have, you, have you lit it already? No, of course not. <laughs> okay. Or you know you could stay in there and die. I I have a suggestion. If uh, if we're willing to you know not get the chest down there, we could just collapse the tunnel. Exactly. But then we wouldn't I'm... have the chest. That is true. I, I'd, I'd be more concerned of a cave in on us. Oh, <laughs> well, as long as you're here, Lex, I'll take a cave in. I I'm. I'll be honest, I'm somewhat looking... You realize these things were decommissioned for a reason. I, I think I would look more towards a cave-in than a giant spider, personally. You see that over there? That's what these things do. And he points over to this. Nice. Nice. <laughs> that was in character, well, that is, by that's the way. That's in this area right here. This general <laughs> area. <sighs> so, if it does that, do we even have to be in the room? Roll persuasion. I'm always rolling persuasion. You are always roll. And that actually worked. Uh, that he's like, how about roll? He he literally just shoves it back into your hands and says, "How about you try yourself?" Fine. Besides, you got you got the protective armor of yours. I was gonna say. Uh, I clear my throat and I'm like. Uh, <clears throat> As the one who cast that spell, maybe I should uh, take the explosive. I, I realize what it might do with you holding that. Sure, here you I go. I just want to point out that uh, Terry has a uh, quick and fleet-footed. I don't know. If okay, that's, that's I, I, I take the I take the explosive from Balmontis, and then I immediately walk over to Terry. And I'm like, "Hey, uh, so it increases my pace by plus two. Yeah, so you run faster. Roll a, d and roll a d10 instead of a d6 when running." You're, yes. You're new. Just, I'll, 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 you uh, prove yourself here. <laughs> All right. I, I just look at Fondle. Four gold. Uh. Oh gold. Very well. Five gold. Four gold. Ten gold. Three gold. Seven gold. One gold, and I don't smash you over the head with my hammer. Are you hack. Three gold. Two silver. Are you, are you haggling? <laughs> yes. Yeah. We're just haggling while I'm while I'm holding this explosive. <laughs> I just start yeah. leaning against I, the wall, just like... I, hmm. I hand him the, the gold. I will take this. Okay. The fuck am I doing? <laughs> Alright. You're gonna take that thing, and... Oh, shit. You're gonna take that explosive, and you're going to go down the tunnel, set it down, and then you're gonna run back here, and we're gonna light the fuse. Alright, cool. So, basically, how would I roll this? I imagine it would be an agility check. How You'd far be doing down... an agi agility so can, check. So, can I just run in there, uh, like, put the explosive, like, put the explosive down and run back out? You want to <laughs> risk losing the chest? Yeah. Alright, very well. So, I, uh, uh, do I, I have to roll the fuse in my action? hand when, when he runs? Actually, um, sorry, uh... Oh, hello, yeah, you're I... in this game. Yes, yes, I am. <laughs> um, yeah, sorry, I was mostly listening in, but um, I did have an idea, because I've got a spell called Barrier, and as I understand it, there's a set limit to the radius and obviously what I can cover. Yes. Would it be possible to cast a Barrier spell over the crate? That's a good question. Um, you, you could, could bullshit do. say yes, because you're the GM. Yes. That is yes. okay. use of I will let, I will let you I will let you attempt a barrier, but you're gonna be really you gotta be really careful because that thing would wake up at any 
opportune moment. Okay, so I've got to get and this the, one. And the babies it has aren't exactly quiet. Awesome. Um, okay, so this would have to be... When... With three of them. Did she follow me here? When when Terry runs down the the tunnel, Thrandall looks like he's like about to light the fuse, and then Zestia runs after him. So he's like, "Shit, all right." <laughs> like, 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 wait! I have an idea. I just look at Thrandall. Seven. Does she run towards the explosion? Thrandall just sighs. Anyway, we okay. want to bet Terry dies. Okay, so I assume that passes. So um, I'm just going to draw. A little bit quickly on this map. Um, hope you don't mind. Um, it would suck if my first character dies right in the first game I'm in. Uh, I wouldn't do that to you. Yay. Uh, okay. Um, and then. Oh, your magic screen. Yeah. No, you wear red. There we go. Um, okay. And barrier is two power points, so I am now on eleven. So well, guess... you should probably start running steal. away. Yep. The yeah, you should get out of here. I, 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 I just I just tap Terry on the head and just go. Bombs all yours. Hell yeah. The mother spider I... begins to look around very edgingly, but does so, it? Can I roll? A, to... Can I roll running to just uh, jump to just like place it? Pl go in here. Place. The I'd say I'd say do an agility check. An agility I, I think check? I'd, I yeah uh, uh, roll your agility. Roll my agility to just get in there and place the bomb without yeah. uh, aggroing her. Yeah. All right. Should I, now because of fleet footage, should I roll a d10 instead of a d8? Uh, that thing only really That's applies that... in combat. Oh, okay. All right. Okay, yeah. All right. All right. Well, my agility is a d8, so. Yeah. All right. And you've got a wild, so you can roll a d6. Like after. a whole ton more like rules come into play in combat so in this. I, I rolled a six. Be yeah, cool. that succeeds. I succeed, so I, I get in there, place the bomb, and run the hell out. Yeah, you just... It's kind of like the slow-mo explosion. You jump out of the way. Alright, so... Uh, you should probably roll... Uh, as Terry's running out, you just, like... So, like, they're in a, Like, they see Terry go into the darkness, and they, like, hear, like, a small shifting, and then, like, a, a sort of hiss, and then you just hear, like... Coming uh, closer and closer, just shit, 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 shit. Okay, uh, Throndal is well. We haven't lit the explosive yet. I don't think have we? Oh, have we? <laughs> well, okay, I, I'll, I'll just. Throndal was holding the fuse for it. All right. Yeah. As soon as he sees Terry, he just grabs the fuse and like presses it up against Balmontes' flaming armor. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. You light the fuse. The the fuse starts going in, and you hear the screeching of the mother spider. It echoes into your ears as you all, like, uh, move back. You slowly start seeing the mother spider, like, crawling out. Like, one of its arms is out, but then, soon enough, you see the crumbling inside. I won! And the spider, you, you, there's the, it goes faint, and all the babies start to scatter. It's dead. I oh. won! Well, That's, we've uh, orphaned an entire cave system. That's I impressive. I didn't quite expect Terry to live through that, but... <laughs> well, let's go Take claim what our I can spoils. Get. You want to claim your spoils? Uh, yeah. Now, you know, then you notice that the chest... Uh, luckily, it isn't locked, uh, but it is very... It is old, dusty, and such. Thrandall stays back with Lex. Where you open it, the Zelda chest opening theme plays, and inside, one gold coin and an old miner's journal. Shit, yeah! While oh, they're I down there, the I want to talk to Lex. I grab the coin. There you go, Terry. I, uh, I, just sit, I just sit against this rock and just start reading the old journal. So It's, it's nothing more than like a miner's tale of how... Um, he had been down here for days, he had been bored of it, but they had apparently have been unearthing something dark and mysterious and can, like can, about can I grab one of the dead baby spiders? Um uh, sure. Alright, I just grab one of them and I walk over uh, to Lex and I throw it to him and just say here as a gift. Well I want to talk to Lex while everyone's down there. Hmm. Uh, I'm just like So uh Mr Lex, you have an issue with Valmontis, I see? 
that's nothing for you to worry about. Don't worry. Well, he is sort of my uh, compatriot at the moment. This rubble is very... Got... Uh... Is there something I should know about him? I know. This rubble likes to party. <laughs> is there something um, I should know about Belmontis? He, go, he goes silent. Hmm. I just very well. well. Just uh, letting you know that if a conflict breaks out, I'm going to take his side. I'll keep that in mind. Very well. See that you do. I thought you'd be more pissed that there was only that in the chest. No, I, I'm just reading this Sorry, journal. Please, please. Yeah. It, it basically it's it's just like the journal entries of a miner that was down here. Hmm. Does it does it detail a giant spider laying eggs in the guy? Oh, oh god, is that a reference to so something? So I, I bring the spider corpse over to Lex, and I say, please accept this gift. It's a reference to the fact that spiders are dicks. Oh, okay. Um, no, but they do talk about, they do mention the, the, bleh, the hordes of spider babies that have been around, but it doesn't talk about a spider mother. Hey, Zestia, you like boring old books. Here's another one. Yes. And I just throw it over to <laughs> I've never seen yeah, she, so she's happy like skip literature. She just uh, happily starts skip, skipping down the corridor and just like humming um, a, a, a tune that her family used she to sing. Starts humming "Reading Rainbow." <laughs> well, it's time well, to. That was you know, I was really, really, really looking forward to you having a fight with that spider. Because <laughs> <laughs> until because if you would. Didn't like just roll three d six damage and see if the it survived the explosion somehow. Uh, no, I, I I liked it so much, so I thought, hey, um, you should just go for it. I like that. Okay. <laughs> I I was being a very generous uh, GM, but if you had stepped, if you had like stepped in onto the uh, platform, I would have had you made a stealth check. Uh, I just walk over to the other tunnel and go, now it's time to see what's behind tunnel number two. And I fire another pistol shot down it. And I start yelling. <laughs> okay. Well. Any loud noises back? You do. What the fuck, I can't. There we are. Well done. You just found some more corrupt minions. Yeah. Alright. Uh, as soon as Thrandall sees him, he... Uh... It's in the Sonic front of the, the tunnel. Hedgehog. You know, that's the first joke it, I made when I saw them with their recolors. Um, the, uh, the the lantern here isn't lit up, but Frondel is able to see down, and there are three angry imps. Uh, and he, they, they begin to descend uh, on you. Alright. Yeah, Throndal just raises his shield, and usual. So I'll move back just a little bit. There we go. Terry positions himself behind Lex. I draw my sword. I ready my staff. And my um, axe. Damn it, I don't want that thing. Brundle grooms his beard. <laughs> uh, let me see. Control. Battle grooming. The ancient art. Oh, yeah. Reshuffle. Um, we can't see our token. Oh, I can't see my token. Yeah. I think it's because really? it's the tokens from the previous map, so you have to add us again. Ah, shiger. Alright, let's just... Yeah, just box to let everything and then control you. There it is. <laughs> the spider ended the spider the turn order because of... <laughs> yes, the dead spider is also <laughs> going to fight. <laughs> You must make sure it doesn't make sure it doesn't die. I'm in my optimal position of being behind, directly behind the Lex the guard. I don't think that would work. Too bad he goes first. Oh god! Wow. So one of the imps literally just bum rushes you as it uh, it rushes over to Frondel and attempts to headbutt it. Nope. Throndle headbutts it back. <laughs> yes, dear? Yes. Oh, uh, sorry. Okay, I, I am Bit going to... Yeah. Um, just say, say, excuse me, excuse me, Baron Montes, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. 
And I'm sure going to um, I'm going to smack it, smack the uh, imp in the face with my staff. So I need Real to roll it. Yeah, five. So that is a hit. That hits it. Yeah. Yep. Um, well, that's against okay. its, its parry. Yep. Yeah, you still hit it. Okay. These imps are weaker than those stalkers we right. just had. Yeah. Three. So don't think that does any damage. Uh no. Okay. It 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 it, it, it you, you do hit it, but it takes the hit without anything. Yeah, just so it like does, twelve. It takes the hit, but it doesn't even notice. Yeah. That and because it's stupid. <laughs> it's a bit dazed from the headbutt. <laughs> So Lex the guard is having difficulty getting past you two. So he sort of just pokes uh, uh, his... Seeing see this is what like, Terry is just like uh, rubbing his hands together and smiling. <laughs> <laughs> Lex no remembers that and he's just going to keep his eye on Terry. <laughs> that is his entire turn. <laughs> Alright. I don't have smite on but I'm going to do my thing. You still, yeah, you're still good against these things anyway. I didn't think you guys would go down this way. <laughs> what you would have learned after this spider. I wish skills was like the first thing after your main stuff, because that's what I use the most. Uh, okay. Great. Why am I rolling so low? I feel like I have a minus or something. Is a four hit? No. Okay. It has to be a five. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and bin it yet. You sure? Yeah. Okay. You have bennied. Delete stats. Great. Same thing as last time. Oh my god. Two attempt swipes, but nothing. To know. Right. Yeah. Maybe Balamontus will like, save the day. It's in Dwarvish, though. No, no, Frondel. This is how you stab things. <laughs> Where the blue neck? Sorry, I'm just trying. I'm just double checking. You know, I should have this down by now, but I haven't been rolling fighting as much as I thought I would. Frondel, her uh, ah. Balmont is just like shoving at our at Zestian Frondel's faces to get by. <laughs> it's like tag teaming. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. you still hit that thing. Yeah, don't hit with a raise, but I'll take it. That you still clob it. It's quite nice. Strength You're hitting it with your uh, sword? Yeah. <laughs> First time I've used it in ages, and it sucks. It's a five. Oh, no, wait, sorry. It's toughness is uh, six. It's parry's five, but it's toughness is six. Tough little bastard. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh no, sorry, no. Damn it, I'm sorry. It, 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 its toughness is five. Okay, like so this time. I stab it once it with the. So it's shaking, yeah, I stab it once with a rapier and then back off so we have some breathing room. <clears throat> That's pretty much my turn. I back off and I just like strafe backwards. Uh, it's, it's friend here literally leaps over it. I'm just going to move this token back a bit just so we can make it. leaps over it and it's going to take some sort of a, like an upper uh, uppercut slash towards a Zestia. Uh -oh. yeah, there, there's a gap there. Damn there. it! These between things Zestia. only roll ones! There's a gap there, too, <laughs> between Zestia and Throndle. It could have totally just went straight for Lex. I know, but it didn't, so it's tough. Lex, I think Lex is cahoots with these guys. Anyway, too, actually. Well, Harry? Oh wait, wait, okay. wait, Neo! You said you've got quick. Yeah. You should have gotten. A, you should have. Oh shit! If you have quick, you can't draw a card below five. Sorry. Wow. Way to go. Hey man, you, you didn't remind it. him. You can just. Re you can just remember you that have, next time. You beefed it. You beefed it. All right. I'm fine My with fault. this. Just do it next turn. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So is Lex keeping an eye on me right now? Yes. Uh, I'm going to run towards the Shadow Imp that just attacked Zestia and try and smash its fucking skull in. You're just gonna squeeze in there? Yeah. So I just go over there. I am tiny, I can do that. 
I just well, realized, why do you only yes, kill a certain hero who's like from a who's playing a fucking race that actually is human sized? Yes. Terry, you're very close to me. <laughs> Terry's just like heavily breathing. Okay, so I can just uh just roll my fighting? It, yes. Right. Are you attempting to attack it with your wrench? Yeah, it's so It's go. fighting. Let's see. Oh, it shit. Guess, oh well, it. it's um, it's this imp down at the bottom, and then um, we'll redo the turn. There we go. <laughs> and then I just uh. Yes, you're at eight. So, I'll raise, but you do attack it normally. Yeah. Alrighty. So it's... Seventeen. Ooh. Seventeen. Um, right. Five. That's can I describe dead. this? That's out of there. You could. Yes. Can I describe? Dis yes. So basically, uh, from the standing position, I take out my fight French, uh, and then uh, strike a pose, and then I fucking like tear like tear ass towards the shadow and jumping, uh, uh, pushing Lex out of the way, and then just do like a small hop and uh, full two-handed smash its head down into the floor. Damn. With my pipe well French. Done. Rip. Well done. Rip in peace. Yeah. Thrundle looks somewhat impressed. Somewhat. Let's see. This is getting really clustered. So I'm just going to delete this one from the uh, area and I'm going to move this guy up here and he's going to avenge his friend. Avenge me. <gasps> oh! Wow. Getting quite close. Is that against? We're in a right trifle. That is against Terry. <laughs> we are in a light, a right trifle. A right trifle. What's your parry, Terry? Terry, Terry. I uh, parry. Where is that again? The top of your sheet. Top of my sheet. My parry is eight. These the guys don't have one. weapons. They're attacking it's on eight arms. Eight so minus one. It's uh, it's just its strength, isn't it? As damage. Oh, you made these monsters, so if you didn't, like, give them a pl like a weapon thing, then... No. Oh, so it's just their strength, then? Yeah. I was just making, I was just making sure. <laughs> oh, they probably Actually, can't possibly uh... this rondel, then. Wow. Can I, can I just ask something? Uh, I have the first strike edge. Which right. says that once per turn, if not shaken, I get a free fighting attack against the foe who's moving adjacent to me. And it automatically interrupts the opponent's attack and does not cost my, me my action if I am on hold or have not yet acted this round. You've already oh. acted, though. Oh, so, yeah. oh well. It's vague wording. I'm gonna. On I hold, think it's, I th I think on it's when. You do anything, and you're waiting, you're waiting to do your oh, action. Oh, okay. Alright, gotcha. So I gotta be uh, yeah. guarding for that to happen. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Gotcha. So it's not, or it's so either guarding or your your turn hasn't come yet. All right, just mm -hmm. all right, all right. Like if they're coming to you, I think. Okie dokie. Uh, uh, um, yeah, that wouldn't. Have, he didn't even hit you anyway. Nice. <laughs> too too fast, too quick. One damage. You probably just knocked an inch off of your cigarette. <laughs> and you're like, now I'm angry. I just pu I just puff smoke in his face. Ooh. Well, I don't need to give you a new card. Heat move. You oh. get to go first. Yes! Yes! God, I'm way down All at right. the bottom. Cestia's on the top. I am now... <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh. I am going oh. to once again smash its fucking skull in. Ho oh. ho. I just look at it, puff smoke in its face, and I say, time to bust some head! Boom. Time to give some head. Yes, you just hit it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so, normal damage. Yeah. Yeah, give him head, Terry. Ooh! Sorry. Damn, it's, it's five. Dead. That's... Yeah, because it's a move. Dead again? This one is dead. <laughs> Once again. I'm too... I just gonna, I just look at the last one. I'm two for three right oh, now. Oh right, yes. So you can also move as well because you didn't move before. Give me one tick. Back in a second. Uh, Thrundle's like Terry. I uh. All right, all right. So uh, seeing that, uh, getting a bit sick of being between Zessia and Throndle, like the the, the little 
I'm just gonna move a bit right behind Destia. All right. <laughs> Thornton's just like, hmm. I uh, think I value mo you more than Balamontis already, Terry. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, sorry. Oh, so it was just the initiation. Now he's a welcome member. Yeah, and then uh, Thornton's tried to and probably rolls really low on his fighting because that's what I've been doing. Very well. You see, the way oh, I made oh. Terry. Yeah, you hit it. And it's, damage. it's shaken, right? It's shaken, yeah. Anything you do now, it, as long as it's over five, it's dead. Well, I don't think I can possibly roll lower than that, because I have a plus four to my damage. It it's It's happened. Mine's happened as well. No, I have a Jack. plus four to my damage, so I have at least a five, no matter what. It's a seven, so yeah. No, it is actually still possible to roll lower. Well, no, because... I have a plus four to it, and I roll a d8 and a d6. So the lowest I could get is a six. Jesus Christ! This is against evil. Yeah, that's it. Okay, all right then. Yeah, it's it's fucked. Do you want to describe or? Uh, it's not a, a big hit this time. It's just more like Thrundle casually says something to Terry, and then he walks forward and you know beats the thing down. Nice. Ah, uh, that day counter is done. So. There we are. He collects more uh, ash into his beard pouches. I just collect to go cheese. He just man, start pulling his beard your weight. That's right. All right. We should wait for. Uh, so I'm back. There we we should wait for Snake. Um, sorry about that. Like I said, I just look at Lex and go, "Jeez, man, start pulling your weight." Yes, you didn't do a single thing that fight of any worth. That it's kind of like your life in a way. Yeah. Oh. All right. I want to investigate. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have. Yeah, to I'm, leave, I'm like, gonna investigate too. You wish well, to investigate? I'm uh, gonna you have to really... leave in like 15 minutes, by the way. Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh. We can. Uh. Just yeah, wrap up sorry. the rest of the K part, I guess. Like this area. Uh. Possibly. Yeah. There is still one more thing, though. Yeah. I mean, it... we can just come back to it next session. Uh, all right. Um, well, you don't really find anything of notice, really. It's just a, it's just a part of the uh, mine that wasn't really uh, dug into. I'm gonna just get it. down this tunnel, just squeeze in, start wandering down. Oh, so it was caved in. So yeah. No, that oh, no, yeah. that part wasn't caved in. That's just that that would that they just stopped digging there. Oh right. Okay. Oh yes, I see. Um, you start to explore down that uh, passageway, um, and this actually takes you onto the near. Uh, oh, actually, I need to just. Uh, actually, I'll copy you from a different map. Yeah, I gotta start to hear something at three. Uh, Thrundle oh. vibrates into this wall. Ah, <laughs> oh, Radical Larry, good to see you. Yes. <laughs> Wait, what's that from? All the time. It's from an image macro. Uh, Radical Larry, is it a, um, oh, I was thinking that Let's Play of, um, This guy is thingy. all business all the time. Let me see if I can find it. Like, yeah, Radical Larry should bring it up. Yeah, let me, uh, link it. You start exploring down further into the mine shaft, and eventually you're met by some, you're met by a staircase. Oh. So... What kind of staircase? Wooden. Oh, okay. <laughs> up or down? Up. Let's go up. So, so you've been going down, and now you're going up. My, my, my. Eventually, this is fancy. Eventually yeah. seek your way up, and behold this your is eyes. This perfect place for a cliffhanger. Next time. Oh, Dragon Ball Z! It's a shame that kind of... It's a shame it went on longer. I did want to fit this in, but you guys want to uh, come back to this next time. Does that sword have an eye? Yeah. Yeah. On the sword the next yeah. episode is titled Lex yeah. Defeated. I, I should have... I should I should hopefully have more time to do stuff next Sunday. Uh, I'll right. probably we'll... be in my dorm. Okay, then. Uh, Sounds uh, good to me. Yeah. So we'll leave it here as you uncover this, and yeah. Okay, sounds good.
The gang and Lex. Not for long, though. Lex Luthor. <laughs> Not for long. We're just like next episode, Balamont's head is on a spike. So what are you gonna ta- <laughs> what are you gonna title this one? Fuck Lex. 